Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Sidika Purity. This is where we learn Kenya Sign Language and we shall be doing more videos of vlogs, fun flows, these talks, African culture, interviews and motivational talks. So guys, today ni mwaleta mgeni, akawambia ye ni nani, anatoka wapi, anafanya nini. Yeah, so welcome to my channel. Asante sana Purity for having me on the YouTube channel. Mm -hmm. My name is uh, Kabibane Kileo Joffrey. Mm -hmm. I am a, a teacher by profession. Mm -hmm. I'm also a youth pastor. I'm also a counselor. I'm also a Bible school teacher. I teach at our East Africa School of Mission. Mm -hmm. I'm a husband, I'm a father, I'm a brother. I'm an uncle mm -hmm. and I'm a consultant. Wow. wow. Yeah. Yes. So today he's here with us. We shall talk uh, several topics with him. We shall share. And guys, where can we find you? Uh, social media platforms or uh, social media platforms so far uh, uh, Twitter mm -hmm. and Kabi Jeff, mm -hmm. uh, Facebook and uh, Kabivan Kilina. Wow. Mm -hmm. Yes. So now guys, we are going to talk about it and before that make sure you subscribe, like, share my videos Yeah, and all will be well Yes Yeah, so now we are going to talk about the youth Yes And the first topic, I want you to talk about the youth in general Yes mm. Aha, the youth in general mm. Now, when we talk about the youth, we are talking about uh, people who have just left childhood they have not entered into marriage, mm -hmm. they are somewhere in between there. Mm -hmm. However, depending on the setup of a given organization, mm -hmm. if it's a religious organization mm -hmm. or a school setup or a home setup, mm -hmm. like I will talk now on behalf of our church, we categorize them 35 and below. Mm -hmm. Those are youths, 13 to 35. And then uh, sometimes it happens that due to one reason or another, someone is beyond 35 and maybe has not entered into marriage, we still have them as youths, but we call them the senior mm -hmm. Yes. So basically those are the people that are undergoing the transition. Mm -hmm. And that is why in school we used to call it adolescent. Mm -hmm. Sometimes it comes early, sometimes it can come a little bit late, but they are going through challenges. Mm -hmm. Of, uh, of transition mm. and uh, sometimes they don't know what to do. Mm. So they need a lot of guidance. Mm. Those are the youths full of energy. Mm -hmm. They can do anything. Medicine. They can eat anything. Mm. And uh, they just want to, to become mm. those are youths. Well, wow. Now let's talk about peer pressure. How has peer pressure affected the youth in general? Okay. Peer pressure. Of course, from the word peer, it refers to guys of a given age. Mm. They can relate either due to the fact that they have a given background setting mm. or due to the fact that uh, they share something in common. Mm. So peer pressure has really affected the youth. Mm -hmm. And uh, what has escalated the whole issue, because when we talk about peer pressure, I would like to submit to us that peer pressure is not a new phenomenon. Mm -hmm. Peer pressure has been there from time in the morning. But what brings in the dynamism as far as peer, peer pressure is concerned in our generation right now mm -hmm. is the fact that there is a lot of influence and freedom of media. Mm -hmm. Therefore, when they have programs and other youths are able to watch them mm -hmm. and see what is happening, mm -hmm. in an attempt to become what others are doing, mm -hmm. then now the pressure comes in and it influences them sometimes negatively mm -hmm. because they try to prove a point mm -hmm. using uh, the influence from the media. And then when they have failed, mm -hmm. they now resort back to some unscrupulous things you hear of uh, uh, committing suicide in America. Because what I wanted to do to impress my peers mm -hmm. has not materialized. Mm -hmm. Therefore, they feel they are let down to society but uh, what we want to tell them is that even if you fail, mm -hmm. my bishop says, uh, it's nothing against you to fall, mm -hmm. but to remain there, that is more disgrace. Mm -hmm. So peer pressure is uh, an aspect mm -hmm. that is real in our society, mm -hmm. and it is indeed happening. Mm -hmm. 
what we can only tell the youths is that mm. watch out mm. because there are programs that are aired like when we used to watch wrestling when we were young mm. a disclaimer would always run on the screen mm. don't we try this at home mm. nowadays it's rare to see that mm. things are displayed mm. you see people are waiting and doing all manner of things mm. and they don't tell you don't try this at home because mm. this was only meant for the consumption of the camera yeah. so when somebody tries to do that to impress another person mm -hmm. that i have discovered something new then pressure drives them to the extremes mm. basically yeah. Na also I wanted you to to explain uh -huh. how does internet mm -hmm. affected the youth today? Uh -huh. Internet has indeed affected them. Mm -hmm. And uh, number one, it has affected them. Before I say how it has affected them, mm -hmm. it has affected them because um, it is free. Mm -hmm. It is freely accessed. In a pattern, there are no restrictions as to which sites a youth can visit and which sites a youth cannot visit mm -hmm. unless a parent has taken what we call parental control yeah. so that they can engage the youth in knowing I have control so that when I give you a gadget yes. you can only access up to this particular mm -hmm. point yeah. so the uh, internet has really affected them mm -hmm. number one, it has made them to be superficial mm -hmm. by superficial I mean fake they are not themselves yeah. Look at the issue of what you see nowadays, people talking about, you know, girls having a big defense. Mm -hmm. They look at it in the media, the sitting apparatus being big. It affects them, and then from there, they will use a hook and crook to make sure how do I modify myself to look like so and so mm. in the name of socialize, in the name of, you know, whatever name they are given. And then, out of pressure, mm. you find somebody has destroyed a life mm. by failing to appreciate how God made you. Yeah. So peer pressure, number one, has affected them in a, in a manner that it has made them lose lives. Yeah. Then, the way I say it, it makes them be superficial. Mm. You are not yourself. Mm. You find a girl, who told you a cat is the only animal that can walk? Even an elephant can walk. And I thank God that nowadays, even through the same media, we have uh, I've seen things like pageant shows for the plant sites. While we are doing, we also appreciate the fact that your plant sites. Yeah. Don't go, uh, you know into the extent of malnutrition mm. to try and fit into the walking thing. Just know your plan signs and appreciate God for what you are. Yeah. So apart from you know making them live fake lives, mm. apart from making them also lose lives, mm -hmm. it has also made them uh, lose their what I call their future. Yeah. They are future in the sense that mm. when all of us are made, mm. we are actually manufactured to fulfill a given purpose. God in his own sovereignty never made us to appear the same. Mm. You can imagine if every boy, every man looked like me, mm -hmm. it would be a very boring one. Yes. If every lady looked like a, 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 a Sidika, yeah. it would be a very boring one. Yes. So that diversity that God gave us, mm. the youth have failed to appreciate it and uh, through peer pressure mm. they want to look like somebody else. Yeah. But then you wonder why they want to look like somebody else in terms of figure. Mm. In, in terms of mabazi, mm. So you find them, they arrive at a level whereby they lose their future. Yeah. And when you lose your future, it's because of trying to create an image. Mm. And then also under this peer pressure, mm. what it has done to our youth that is very detrimental mm. is that it has made some of them mm. uh, uh, also arrive at a state whereby mm. they suffer identity crisis. Yeah. In short, what is identity crisis? Not knowing uh, what you're supposed to be. Mm -hmm. Not accepting the same. Not accepting the same. Living in denial. Living in denial. Mm -hmm. So I meet today Koech is watching in a is walking in a different way. Mm -hmm. I want to be like Koech. Mm -hmm. I find men walking in a different way. I want to so I suffer identity crisis. Mm -hmm. And these things, by the way, as we talk about them through this channel, mm -hmm. they are as old 
as time itself. Yeah. There's nothing new. Mm. They just keep mutating as time goes by. Yeah. So basically those are, those are the things I can highlight as far as how this peer pressure has affected you. Yeah. And many other yes. Yes, yes. So how can we empower the youth? Mm. Yeah. Number one, how do we empower these youth? If you're outside there, hit that subscribe button, like this page, on this platform, yeah. we are empowering you. Yes. <laughs> so what such like things mm. watch such like youtube channels yes before you go outside there and you know just go at random watching any tom dick and harry show outside there on youtube mm. get to know the title mm. what is this thing talking about yeah if it is talking anything that is educative mm. then go for it yes watch it and the bible says my people perish for lack of knowledge mm. this is knowledge we are bringing to you at the comfort of your room you're seated there the moment you continue following this thing and pursuing it, mm. you will be built and you will have what I like referring to as value addition in your life. Yes. Number two, apart from watching this YouTube channel, mm. uh, we say that you are a sum total of the average of your friends. Yes. Therefore, if you realize the friends you have, anything you have, anytime you are close to them, Mm -hmm. and you tell them you did something wrong mm -hmm. then they tell you ah your wrongness is 10 percent mm -hmm. let's show you how to prove it mm -hmm. those are the type of people you're supposed to run away from mm -hmm. like yesterday yes. because they are not helping you exactly. when you tell them okay mm -hmm. that is negative peer influence yeah such like people disconnect from them. Yeah. Watch our back to what, what we call at an arm's length. While you are there, who high, high, who go high, who go high, in a shell. Like in bringing them in your inside circle, mm -hmm. they will corrupt you. Mm -hmm. So keep away the wrong company. Mm -hmm. Then the next thing that you're supposed to do to make sure that you overcome this peer pressure is that the Bible says, whatsoever things are good, mm -hmm. whatsoever things are noble, mm -hmm. whatsoever things are praiseworthy, yeah. whatsoever things, uh, you know, it goes on and on. Mm -hmm. If there be any virtue in them, think about them. So, ensure that your thought patterns are in line with things that are good. Yes. Because when God created man, mm -hmm. he put in a will to choose. God is not a dictator. But yes. at a way to subscribe to a YouTube channel is a decision you have made. Mm -hmm. So the way he has given you the decision, make sure that you make it right. Yeah. Because as you live, you, are, you have only one life to live. Yeah. Different from what you're living right now. Okay. So just ensure that whatsoever things are good, whatsoever things are, are of praise money, whatsoever things, you know, people, you can look at them and say, Guys have gone through this direction and they have made it in life. Yes. You will be able to overcome. Then be a person of your own principles. Some of us, you talk to them and you ask them, what would you like to become in the future? Mm -hmm. Whatever, <laughs> anything that comes my way. Hapo utapata peer pressure ita kunyorosha. Believe you. Yes. One time I was talking to another gentleman. So I can let you We talk, we talk, we come up here, you know, you can do this, you can do this, you can become, when you concentrate on these subjects, you can become this. And then something told me, can you ask the young man, what would you like to become in the future? So you can be okay, 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 okay. The answer he gave me, that did not say because he may be watching on this YouTube channel. And if I had to come up, what I had told him was amounting to zero. Because after all the capacity building I had done to him, I discovered my efforts were futile. So that should have been the first question. Mm -hmm. What would you like to become before I talk to you? Mm -hmm. So the moment you have a path that you know you are charting that path, you must ensure that you avoid negative peer pressure. Okay, Look at the people that run and win marathon races. Mm -hmm. I was watching this uh, 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 guy who is trending nowadays in Kenya, none other than Ferdinand Omanyana. Mm -hmm. And I listened to him talk about his diet and I said, my goodness. For him to arrive at where he is, mm -hmm. there are so many pleasures mm -hmm. that he had. He has had to put aside. Yeah. Omanyala cannot visit you and eat any junk that you have prepared. Mm -hmm. Because when he does that, wakati ya taenda kufanyua anti-doping, mm -hmm. some of the foods we eat, zitaonyesha ametumia uh, doping, 
amefanya dope na kumbe anafanya zinapatikana kwa chakula he is very particular akitoka kwa nyumba if it is not food prepared by his wife na anajua iko hivi na hivi or by you know athletics association of kenya that cannot uh, ensure that he enters into doping anatembeanga tu na maji yake ama na party yake that is how you are supposed to be as a youth avoid people that you know they may look good friends but they have a very very negative thoughts towards you because your current status is what you are looking forward to Mm. is their prayer book. so yes. basically ukiwachukia wachukia vizuri wamulike na ile jicho lingine use the sixth sense naangalia huyu tuko na yeye lakini mazee haya bana tunaye kwa mara ayo kama yeah yes mm. thank you so much for sharing so a lot yeah. and i welcome you back again wow i'm yes. so happy yes. i'm so humbled that you accepted to be here with mm-hmm. me So guys, we are heading into the next video. Make sure you subscribe, like and comment. Goodbye.